Hello everybody, my name is Maggie and today we're about to play Natural Instincts. This game just came out, but it's been on my wish list for over a year. You can see we've got a boar back here, which is awesome. We've got deer here, which is awesome. And I assumed there would be deer, seeing as it's also pronounced Nystagural Instinct. Okay, my sister has played this already, but I have not. This is first look. I suppose I'll play the tutorial. European forests. A land inhabited by plenty of fascinating species. I like his voice. Together, a perfectly balanced ecosystem. Our journey begins in one of those forests. However, to be able to fully experience the richness of these woods, we must learn how to move around them. Once you know how to control the camera, your first task is to look around the map and find the rabbit. This fluffy animal is certainly gambling somewhere in the grass. I love a good frolic. That's a rabbit. If I've ever seen one. To select a group of animals, hold the left mouse button and drag the rectangle over as many of them as you want to select. When an animal is selected, you get access to its statistics panel. There you can check the number of selected animals and their energy, hydration, and satiety levels. To make the panel disappear, uncheck the animal by clicking on the empty spot on the map. Now try to deselect the rabbit. I shall not deselect the rabbit. I shall name him Hubert because that's adorable. Okay, we've got the girl rabbit. Now you know oh, where no. to look for information about animals. Try to find a hungry rabbit on the map. I think much more important than eating the rabbit is naming them adorable little names because they're adorable little creatures. So we've got Hubert, Huberta. Okay, he's hungry, so let me check. Maybe I should have paid attention to the tutorial. Uh, it's getting dark. And Hubert, Hubert is hungry, and I don't know this what to do. Is hungry. Hubert time. How on earth do we feed him? I really should have paid attention. Okay. Uh, control quick. Control, click Hubert. Some of these animals are hungry. Okay, grab him. Hubert. This animal is hungry. Oh, left click. I mean, right click. Oh, I'm so happy for Hubert. Eat the clover, little buddy. Wish I could eat some. Sounds delicious. Now that they are fed, rabbits can do something else. There's it's an now arrow. time to search for a source of water. Fortunately, there are many ponds and streams available nearby. Oh, here's water. Do 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 do. Okay, where's the rabbit? Man. Okay, that didn't do anything. Surely rabbits should be in a meadow, right? I mean, rabbits are meadow creatures. Oh, there. Okay, awesome. Who's thirsty? This uh -oh. animal is thirsty. Huberta is thirsty. Oh, Huberta is absolutely on the move. Uh oh, I hear roaring in the distance. That doesn't bode well for our rabbit. Now that the basic needs of those magnificent creatures are satisfied, we can observe the start of their mating ritual. As the male approaches the female, they start performing a sort of dance, where the female fights off the male until he proves to be the wooden partner. Tender to the lair. <laughs> The lair. <laughs> um, 
maybe I should rename them Doofenshmirtz. There they are. After mating, the rabbits have to go to their shelter. Unfortunately, they don't have one yet. Go ahead and assign them a burrow in which they can hide and rest. Well, I wouldn't know a burrow if it hit me in the face. However, I do see an arrow going this way. Oh, here we go. Oh, pigs! Looks like another species has arrived in the forest. Wild boars have entered the area searching for food and shelter. It seems that they will need some help. What do you mean? This animal is hungry. Well, definitely eat some mushrooms then. Gonna have to name her something amazing. Um, I don't know. What do we name her? What better than Suey? Oh no, 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 stop, stop! Um, what do we do? Now, as they have already crossed the road and finished eating, wild boars need some rest. Oh, good. I saved her beef bowl. And here we are. You need to go here. With a layer. It's advantageously situated next to some mushrooms. If I were a pig, I'd want a layer here. Looks very lovely. More mushrooms? Oh, that's sexy one. Suey, where's your babies? Predators are an inherent part of the proper ecosystem, and their presence helps regulate the number of other animals. A wolf, known for its hunting skills, has arrived in the forest in the search for prey. Fortunately, rabbits are playing on the other side of the road. This is an excellent target for a hungry predator. So we spot a she-wolf here. Let's name her something. Henrietta. That's a lovely wolf name. Okay, now we're going to sick her on the rabbit. Where's Henrietta? Come on, Henrietta, time is money. <gasps> there she is. Come eat an innocent baby rabbit for me. Uh oh, here we go. Little snacky snack. The animal world is governed by the laws of nature, even if sometimes they may seem brutal to us. Unfortunately, for this particular rabbit, life has ended its course. But for others, it just starts going on. Look, a bunch of small defenseless bunnies has just appeared next to the rabbit hole. Charming. However, where new life begins, instructions end. Now you know how to take care of the forest and its fauna all by yourself. Good luck, then. Do I? Do I know how to take care of the forest and its fauna? I don't feel prepared. their leader on his last journey. As his last breath fades, the wolves mourn the dead member of the pack. Where is he? Oh, there he goes. <laughs> the pack leader is gone. The Not wolves funny. need some care before we can find a new alpha male. Bit and snapped at one another. They thought, oh, okay, somebody's trying to be the alpha here. 
so I'm not sure their science is 100% accurate on this game, which is a bit sad because it's a science game. Okay, we've got to find a strongy. Let's name them first of all. He has great eyesight, so we will name him Clarence. Much work and effort to rearrange the normal pack. Well, I've got to name them first. This animal is thirsty and tired. Okay, well, um, he's very aware, but he has less eyesight, but he's vital. So we'll name him Grandpa Jack. Well, she has a very poor metabolism. Annie. This animal is hungry and tired. And we'll name this one Eloise. So which one do I want to be an alpha? Or did I already make Clarence the alpha? Hungry, thirsty, and tired. Okay, hungry, thirsty, and tired. Why don't you go take a drink? That sounds like a great idea for a, for somebody thirsty. This animal is hungry, thirsty, and tired. This animal is dead. Thirsty dog. That one's awfully thirsty, apparently. This animal is hungry. Okay, well, we'll need to find a rabbit. Why, here's a rabbit. Go get him. Go get him, tiger. Where? Wow, there's a lot of rabbits. There he is. Oh, he's just tired. Where did Wolf sleep? What does the den look like? Does it look the same as for a rabbit? See, I don't feel ready. Do they sleep here? No, that's not a den. That's like a... That's where the hogs rest. Oh, this looks like a den. That... Oh, that's a burrow. Ooh. <gasps> There's something. Uh... Here? This animal is tired. Well, come over here, Eloise. You're tired too. Let's all go to the den. We need you to drink some water. That's the boundary. Let's see if we can't find any water on the other side of the road. There we go. There's water. Help the wolves survive these difficult times and look after them until they go back to normal. Okay, so we're going to have to make sure they stay alive for five minutes. Sounds horrible. <laughs> That's responsibility for you. Grandpa Jack still needs a drink. Come on. Come on, Grandpa. Any hungry? Get the rabbit. Get the rabbit. Get the rabbit. Get the rabbit. Eloise is hungry and thirsty. Can you get some water? And Annie. Didn't we just send Annie off on a hunt? Well, no, we didn't. We sent her to stand there. Eat the rabbit. Eat the rabbit. Eat the rabbit. Here we go. Let's go. There we go, there we go, there we go. There she goes. I don't think any of them are dead yet. Any. She's doing good. Clarence. It's also doing good. Grandpa Jack is doing good. They're all doing pretty good. I'm not worried about them. The rabbits are downright plentiful. Come on. Go get this rabbit. Hungry Eloise. Annie seems tired. Why don't we send her to bed? Grandpa Jack's a little tired. Send him to bed. Let's send them all to bed. They only need to live for 30 more seconds. So unless they get hit by a car, I think everything's going to be fine. Send 
10 seconds or so. Okay, now it's 10 seconds. Come on, guys. You can do it. Awesome. They live. It was time to put the new leader to the test. Deer hunting seems to be a suitable challenge for him. I don't know. There seems to be plenty of rabbits. Uh, Grandpa Jack, uh, get the dough. Get the dough. And Eloise, you get the dough. Annie, you get the dough. Clarence, you get the dough. Everybody go for the dough. They are in hot pursuit. And their pursuit. Species. That means hairy. Oh, here they go. Come on, guys. You can do it. Oh, that was that was easy. We need to hunt a whole herd of deer. Well, I'm not so sure that's entirely realistic, especially with the abundant availability of rabbits. We're not here for the scientific accuracy, are we, kids? We're here for the game. Unless you are here for the scientific accuracy, in which I'm a little sorry. Wantonly killing wolves simulator. My pets are going to be tired after this. Set by four wolves. How did he have a chance? Fifteen wolf pups. Good grief. Well, I guess the thing to do here is make sure they're hydrated. Oh, she's ready to mate. Which male wolf? But I want Grandpa Jack to be the alpha. Okay, Grandpa Jack. And where is Annie? Grandpa Jack and Annie and Grandpa Jack. There we go. They're all completely fine. Oh, six puppies. Oh wow. Oh, I gotta name them. I gotta name them. Whew. Uh, young male. Oh, he's too young to follow my orders. I see. So, uh, who is the mom? Must be Annie with the cut she mated first. So let's name him after his dad, Jack. Jack Jr. So it's Jack Jr. She's a young female. Let's name her after her mom. Annette. Young female, um, Louisa, I don't know. Young female, Butter. Young male, Toast. Young female, Butter toast. Okay. Got them named. Eloise, why don't you take a little nap? Annie, take a little rabbit. And Bob Jack, take a drink. Oh, we've got more wolf pups. You know what that means. Time to name them. Female. Out of Grandpa Jack and Eloise, let's name her. Eleanor. This one can be named. Mouse. Ooh, he has very fast regeneration. This one has very fast regeneration too. Uh, her name shall be. Uh. Uh. Paused. Clarence can use a nap. 
that all you could use. A little water. These woods are crawling with wolves. Oh my grandpa Jack needs a nap. And you can use a little sip sip. Fragrance is after the rabbit. We'll fulfill our quest yet. Oh, the female wolf is ready to breed. Miss Annie. Go ahead over here. Now we're just waiting on some pups. What is licorice? Oh, it gets hungry faster. Is that a bird? Congratulations! Ooh. You have bred a strong and healthy alpha male to lead the pack. It looks like the wolves don't need your help anymore and are able to survive on their own. Excellent. Who is this? Is it Jack Jr.? Who is this? I want to know! Well, I suppose that's all for today, folks. I do want to know who's the alpha, though. I, I took care of those wolves. I named them. This has been Natural Instincts. Hope you have a wonderful day.